Hey guys, this is Alan Fregman and Mikel Campos for TD Survival in stereo. Yeah, I think <laughs> so. We have two microphones, first time ever working. <laughs> so, so, um, let's talk about gear. Yeah. We didn't talk about gear yet. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, a yeah. Couple, couple of times. <laughs> a few times. Yeah. <laughs> Well, and we're going to continue with the um, uh, facial models. Um, okay. This one, it's I think it's a bit more um, easy to use than the A-Leads <laughs> in the video before. And uh, first, uh, uh, I would like to, to uh, present our little character for TD Survival that was kindly modeled and provided to us by uh, Jose Manuel Linares. So Thank Jose you. Manuel is an awesome modeler. He yeah. has an awesome characters and really nice sets too. Really yeah, populated. Yeah, really good. And yeah. uh, we want just to thank Jose Manuel for this model. Yeah. Uh, we will use it soon in more uh, examples. Yeah. So thank you, Jose Manuel. Thank you very much. Yeah, very much. <laughs> well, so let's start with the uh, next model, mouth. So yeah. First thing first. I need to visualize all my uh, sides of the model. So the mouth, the mouth, it's uh, probably one of the most, uh, I will say uh, that I've been using for most uh, time or for longer time of all the facial uh, models that we have uh, now in, in gear. Yeah. And probably is the most refined one in terms of uh, versioning. It, this version, well, here it appears like it's version uh, one, but indeed it's uh, it's not the version one. It was the I don't know if it's uh, the lock their mouth. Uh, yeah, it's say it's version one, but it's not. Indeed, it's it's like version five or something. <laughs> but yeah, first a uh, public release of so version one. Uh, okay, so I'm gonna. Cool. I'm gonna create a little uh, b -b 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 head. Let's create. Um, okay, I'm gonna draw like a little head here. So I'm gonna um, put there and oh, the factor position. Okay. Well, I'm not sure what I did. I think this is going there. And this is, I'm just placing a quick, quick uh, neck and head. Um, okay. So, oops, this is the default gear uh, head. So I'm placing like that. And now I'm going to create the mouth. So select the mouth uh, choo -choo -choo, and uh, draw it from the side. So first uh, is the, the jab pivot. You need to place okay. there. Second click, it's the um, jab. Uh, yeah, the chin or the, I call this jab tip. Okay. Smart. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now we have the tongue that I, I hide it, but it, you need to click three times and let's say the tongue is around there. And later you, you have the back teeth position and the front teeth position. Okay. After finish your clicking, it will generate the uh, all the extra uh, positions that you, you should have on your mouth. And let's check out this thing. So I'm gonna go to perspective and we have here. I'm gonna I'm gonna create a quick uh, group here. And yeah, this is oh, it's a sneak peek for a new feature. It's called toggle selectivity in groups. <laughs> it's uh, <laughs> it will be released in the next gear uh, uh, update, and uh, it's basically a common this shortcut the oh, toggling. Yeah. So you can hide and hide groups, and now you can uh, you cannot see there, but now it's selectable. Oh, cool. like shortcut and it's unselectable useful. you can use it yeah <laughs> very useful actually. very useful <laughs> that's a neat sneak peek okay so let me rearrange this this thing a little bit so it clear a little what's going what's going on there i'm gonna move this i forget one yeah 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 this one this as you can imagine are the lips and uh, we it's have like a robot mouth. <laughs> yeah, robot mouth. It looks like a pixel art thing, but with control. So yeah. Okay, so this one, it's the you can sometimes I just uh, deactivate the child uh, or activate the child compensation, so I don't move this when I 
I already placed it. So if I want to rearrange, so I have the let me let me explain this a little more because I have uh, the tongue, the talker. Uh, okay, this is this and this. I think it's the oh my gosh, <laughs> I have too many uh, geometry there. Okay, now much better. So these two are for the teeth. Um, the, and the tongue are... Do you have bottom teeth as well? Two? Yeah, it's it. well, this is for the center of the teeth. Uh, it can be oh. uh, improved, honestly, but uh, it's how I'm, I'm using it right now. So okay. uh, it's working. Okay, that, that's, that's the tongue. So I just place there. Okay, now it's way cleaner. And let me uh, do, 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 upper teeth and uh, lower teeth. I'm going to hide it. And I have the tongue here. Uh, so where is the head? Okay, let's hide it. Well, I'm going to hide first the tongue. So let's start with the um, the jab control. The jab control, we have three positions. Uh, the first one is what we said by default. It's the where the the jab will articulate. I used to yeah. put it uh, here near to the uh, position also of the of the head. Oh, okay. I shouldn't have moved that now. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I can put it right there. And normally it's uh, just below the ear, no? Yeah, exactly. It's around Pretty there. Yeah. yeah. So the second one that you can see here, and it's called if you you open um, uh, PPG, it's called. Jab C, it means center. So oh, that okay. one, it must be a line. Doesn't matter uh, the 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 height uh, um, or the depth, but it's more important where is aligned with the mouth. Okay. I explain you later because you have later a control here on the chin that you can yeah. rotate in Z. Oh. So it will pivot around this this uh, uh, oh, rotation okay. position. So it has different uh, behavior if you move mm. that yeah. also rotates and if you rotate. So that's okay. important for okay. that. Later, I uh, used to place the. Um, I'm gonna select this one, and just make it smaller, so everything will be smaller, so it's easy to control. And the second I used to place first, it's the um, um, the tongue. So I'm gonna unhide the tongue and uh, hide the, the mouth, and the tongue. It's Honestly, it was something I, I was planning to to do more uh, complex one, but at the end it's just a simple uh, FK chain. Ooh, <laughs> shame on me. Yeah. Well, in the I, I I've done some some strange uh, tongue rigs in the past, and in the end, most animators are pretty happy with some FK. Okay, yeah, honestly, the tongue. the tongue doesn't do anything too crazy, to be honest. It just yeah. Well, flaps. I saw some of crazy things with tongue, so I was like, yeah. you know, you, you always wanted the ultimate rig, and at yeah. the end, you you end up with what you can, uh, what you. And in the end, it's like I wanted to do this, and you're like, I can't yeah. quite do that because <laughs> it's very complicated. Exactly. So, yeah. well, so the tongue is already in place, and now the teeth. For the teeth, I'm, I'm gonna hide again the tongue and show the teeth. Um, hey, where is the teeth? The lower teeth here and uh, upper teeth. There is it. And again, I'm hiding that just to uh, better uh, visualization. So that was intended initially. Uh, it was intended to have like a direction thing, so you can arrange like that directionality. Okay. Uh, I think uh, some of the the well, I think it's always a stray because I, I didn't plug that, but you need to put it like that. <laughs> That's the thing. And it's important to put it more or less in the center. So you will have like two deformers, one for the upper to uh, teeth and one for the lower teeth. Yeah. And later we have this um, area here that it's for the lips. So first, uh, what I will recommend here is to apply some constraints to symmetrize. I will show uh, another, another day uh, how to cheat in gear that it's kind of cool <laughs> <laughs> yeah you can you can bypass some stuff or regenerate some stuff from scratch or but this let's say it's it's an uh, also an advance or a sneak peek of how to cheat in gear <laughs> <laughs> so what i do normally it's i take this control here yeah. and i use a, a simple symmetry constraint so i go here and use this symmetry constraint so click there and 
Well, this is gonna open, so I have my special don't be annoying PPG, please, <laughs> interface. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> so go there. And the, the rotation doesn't matter. Too no, much place, no? A gear, uh, okay, that I mistake. Uh, gear, it's only, um, indeed, uh, it only taking account the uh, positions. So it's only positions. For this guy. No, for all the guides. Oh, really? and for all guides. Yeah, yeah, that I should uh, make maybe another uh, video one day. It, mm. And basically, uh, if you need to handle rotations, uh, you have these the blades that are the, oh. um, or you have one, for example, some of the, um, of my guides have uh, like positions that indicates that it's kind of a vectoring thing. So yeah, it's yeah. how you define directionals. Okay, but okay. normally it's only position, so it doesn't matter if it's flipping or rotating oh, or okay, everything. Okay. It's it's, yeah. it's just position. The symmetry constraint usually kind of flips it. And, yeah, yeah, that makes that it's w way easier to um, play. Place. Yeah, nice. well, to place a guide, but yeah. also you 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 have some. Um, to take in an account some some uh, like yeah uh, I don't know <laughs> sorry I don't know uh, <laughs> how they work but you need to uh, to take in account some uh, like uh, behaviors like for example if you if you want to define a, a, a an arm or something and uh, because it's only taking position so if you if you don't know uh, how to place correctly the position maybe when you rotate the the arm and you expect that your arm with the pivot here will rotate in this direction. Yeah. And maybe because you place the position a little a bit lower the yeah. the elbow, so instead go go more like in upper or rotating like that. Right. So that is the thing that you need to take in account when you do this. But yeah, I will maybe it's a good um, point to make another video here. Okay, so let's continue with the mouth. Uh, okay. You're replacing the lips? Exactly. So the lips, uh, yeah, can be placed. I can close this. I don't need it. Okay, so go center. Would you recommend uh, turning on the snapping to surface? Or, uh, or you just no. like to? Honestly, no. Here. It's it doesn't need to be a great. It just does uh, the pivot need to be like inside the lip, like at the center of the the flesh of the lip, or on the outside? Or yes, technically. Like near the teeth, teeth depth. Yeah, technically, yes. You need to um, uh, to place it on on the on the depth. But honestly, I, you you can barely see the difference. So I tend to put it just barely on the surface of the lip okay. uh, because it's easy to handle. Yeah, okay. it's, it's just, uh, I'm gonna make it slightly smaller at all, so it's easy to, to see the spaces. Okay, so very, the ideal it's if you have like looping like that, it's to put evenly distribute all the controllers, so yeah. around there, and this one, it goes around there. Is it's quite fast to put all these things there, and this one it's just to control the directionality here. For this version of the mouth, uh, maybe it's not needed, but I I like to put it like that because I, I have other controls that can go that direction. Oh, but it's not in this. I think it's not in this version. So again, it's um first uh, release version. Yeah, but it's not the only version. Not the last version either. Yeah, definitely. It's not the last. <laughs> I hope. <laughs> okay, so it's going well. Let's put it there. And this one around there. And there. So, okay, let's um, choo -choo -choo, put it there quickly. Okay. Okay, this one maybe needs to be lower just in the corner does it have to be in the exact like fold in the corner and does it make a big difference no not really okay well must be i mean well centered like don't be too dirty working but <laughs> <laughs> but yeah you can put it like that okay so i think it's um always take a shower before you work um excuse me you said don't be too dirty work too dirty working D yeah <laughs> <laughs> okay, so um, you have it there, more or less. Just a quick review. So we put, uh, you, we place the tongue, we place the teeth. We have all the pivots in the right place, more or okay. less. Yeah. 
<laughs> so let's generate the rig so we can go to other explorer more larger and take this gear guides pull from selection and mouth sample something i don't know that's not important the name right now so let's generate this and bloop, 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 it's generating awesome so what we have here na, 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 it's uh we don't need the guide anymore so i'm gonna just keep it in another group and hide it okay and let's review what uh we get we have these controls for the um uh tongue and they're just like they're just fk controls you said yeah just it's right fk open. control we have this chin or jab control that it can open and close the mouth okay we have these direct direct controls there that it's a kind of uh, direct control for the envelope in the formers and we have this or, or is that for Oh. Is it for the Doritos or? No, that, these ones are not Doritos. And honestly, uh, this is just for quick uh, control if you need it. Um, I will explain in another uh, videos. Okay, do you want to change your color scheme to improve performance? Hell no, I want my color scheme. Sorry guys for this. <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, yeah, I was talking, yeah. I, I, I have another system that goes on top of this one. Yeah. Uh, again, uh, will be in future videos, courses, or something. I will explain. I promise. Again, so we have these two controls that are for the um, teeth. So what I like to go here first, it's rearrange or um, oops, wrong shortcut. I like to um, again rearrange my um, a little bit like that and uh, go here in uh, parent mode and go like that a little so it's going up and maybe i just move one up a little bit so when um when i close my mouth they have slightly separation yeah and uh, well i now close the mouth press it so you see now your teeth control are up and down right, right. you you know in gear you you can store later the um um control shape so yeah. if you regenerate your guide you don't need to um reshape it to reshape it and also yeah. the colors that was uh the latest update on on oh. that area okay yeah. it's another video i think that it's already uh, there okay mm, cool. ba -ba -bum. yeah i want to proportional guide in choo -choo -choo. put like that okay where's my yeah and i move like that so uh look at that beautiful shape very nice yeah again you can change your colors I, I don't know i don't like this color scheme so i'm gonna again wear a color i've got some red ones and this one i'm gonna put it greens well i think must be enough with that yeah you can see clearly okay so this one also Let's readjust the points there. You can freeze later the modeling, so you don't yeah. have in dirty uh, storic there. Okay. Uh, and I think maybe just offset. Okay, there's it. Okay, so first part done. We have the nice controls place, and let's continue with the um, enveloping. So I normally I do the this later I do the enveloping and finally I fine tune the preferences on the on the mouth. Yeah. So it can work better with uh, your character. But this right. uh, for that you need to to have it enveloped. So I'm gonna remove the head from this um, group. So choo -choo -choo, what I'm doing? Yes, here remove from group. Okay, and the rest of the group and I just don't need it. So I'm gonna hide it and quick enveloping so select here and uh, where's my rig mode sample we have these uh deformers i'm gonna unhide these ones so for uh speed seek i'm, I'm gonna just uh envelope the mouth uh, i mean the whole head first um to one object so I'm, I'm not gonna envelop the the neck or anything. For, yeah, yeah. And the it's video will be long, so, so long. So <laughs> first, okay. The first that I, I will recommend to to envelop this it's um to start with the with the jab. So first things, 
just uh, again like re envelope so I don't want to reassign locally so I add a new um, object that I didn't check this is the of course this is not the right <laughs> so, undo undo yeah that's what I'm doing undoing and this is the okay so this is the job that I envelope the mo the head and this okay. is the head that is where I should envelope first so <laughs> okay. uh, great for me mm, let me uh, remove envelope and do it again so I'm gonna use my shortcut this one cool and now I'm adding the other without touch the envelope so I have this one yellow and again first just open the mouth so for open the mouth I select something around here expand my selection around there and check inside it's more or less working again outside do it quick selection with polygons uh, that's a fast way to do it fast I don't know you can use the uh, the symmetry yeah you have these uh, the gear you have a symmetrized uh, selection oh. Okay, I was gonna say the the symmetry painter. Ah, uh, the, the symmetry, but no, I'm uh, I'm not used. Yeah, I, I know we, we have that. a video on that, yeah. <laughs> actually. But uh, yeah, you know what? I'm not used to you. Um, yeah, it's like yeah, you know, do you have tendency to to they use what you? Yeah, they have it exactly. So let's say this is my approx. I don't need to be. Perfect. It's like a five o'clock shadow. Yeah. So uh, I switch with my shortcut. It, probably you don't have <laughs> to point <I> <laughs> yeah you can use but uh, i mean the point is not to show how to use soft images to yeah. use this this specific yeah, exactly. model so when you have this um if you don't have a shortcut I, I, you can right click and select adjacent points yeah you can go here now i'm gonna explain it select the uh, i just say points it, it's my shortcut it's p Ooh, that's an undisclosed here my <laughs> secret <laughs> Okay. You know the secret is out. Yeah. No, I'm I'm screw. I'm I'm, yeah. I'm out of the business. Okay. <laughs> so um, I'm gonna avoid more shortcuts for the moment. So maybe I'm slower. So reassign locally, and I'm gonna reassign this. to This one. So, Very nice. Yeah. So what I get it's now I can open the mouth. <sighs> awesome. Well, well, awesome, awful. So yeah, this is how I open the mouth. Yeah. <laughs> so now go sh and it's just, like the, just like the guide at the beginning uh, I don't all straight yeah all, yeah exactly that's it that's it <laughs> uh, that's the point so I'm gonna go here and smooth all this like it doesn't need to be um, so perfect for the moment but I mean this is not only how to use it's uh, I think it's only a nice uh, tricks for um, oh look at my my mouse is going crazy oh oh no, I'm not kidding. Where is my? <laughs> she reset your reframe. Yeah, yeah. No, I just I don't know. Oh, you might have. A, I think you held S and then you held Control by accident. Yeah, probably because I'm clicking buttons like crazy. Yeah, I think uh, yes, yeah, what I did because I'm using smooth. Okay, so well, that that's um a little so maybe. Okay, maybe we can speed up this video a little bit. The magic of editing. Yeah. So, okay, it's going slow. Oh. You don't like to use the symmetry when you're painting the smoothness mm, of your job? No, I do it later. Oh, okay. I'm, I don't. I don't use that. Uh, yeah. Okay, so. In this case, for the video, I'm, I'm just gonna <laughs> go brute force. Yeah. Like me, like brute force. Okay. Well, again, it's I, I asked stop. Uh, I think it's because I'm recording the video, so it's uh, also slow here. Okay. So, yep, where I am. Okay. I'm inside the mouth. Awesome. Say ah. Uh, oh. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's because the video recording it's taking so long to smooth this and that, and my super machine it's not going faster as usual. Okay, well you can do that with the smooth tool or I just using the brush 
uh, because I'm, I'm kind of caveman here. Okay, well, resetting the camera. You know, uh, it's all reset. I, I, I changed my shortcuts lately, so... Okay, so we have this thing. Okay. That it's not so great for the moment, but... No. <laughs> what? Not... Okay, go out now. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's my apartment. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> it's, well, but you have the first part of the mouth working, but again, you don't have the lips contact, you don't have anything. But what I'm doing, why I'm doing this, it's because I want to open the mouth before reassign the rest. So close the mouth and I'm going to select here. Mm, well, first, I'm going to hide this uh, 3D geometry. And if you check carefully here on all these controls, you have this, it's for the upper teeth. Okay. And this one that it's for the lower teeth. So I'm gonna same some Which using. Which ones are the deformers? The the black cubes? Or the purple? Yeah, the, the black cubes. The I'm gonna make it smaller now because they are in um like implicit cubes. So I'm gonna oh, okay. do this like that, completely random, and this also like that, completely random. So now when I close my mouth. I can make a little distinction between both these. This is the up teeth, so it's slightly bigger. Okay. I, I will envelop up this uh, at the end. So for the moment, let's keep it like that and reopen. And you can see this, that have this directionality that we've set before. Yeah. And uh, ta -ta -ta -ta, select these ones. Okay, this one and just to oop, forget one. Okay, better like that so you yeah, it's totally make more sense. And I'm gonna create a group that I'm gonna create. A, whoops, whoops, typo, tongue. I don't know if I spelled tongue correctly, but I think so. Yeah. Yeah, you did. Okay, so um, I have this group that I'm gonna use later. So close them all. So we have the right or the neutral position of the uh, initial assignments for the envelope, the static yep. state. And I'm going to reassign uh, the same way. I'm go envelope, uh, set envelope, don't touch the envelopes, and add a tongue deformer. So we have the tongue deformers. Okay. But instead to reassign it locally here, I'm open the mouth. That's a snit trick. And I go here. Select a loop, select some, well, maybe too much around there. And now um, select my adjacent points. And with this open and uh, with the uh, already assigned um, deformers in the neutral yeah. pose, okay. I reassign locally. So what it's doing is, hmm. uh, yeah, that's a nice trick also because instead I show you back uh, what is going on if you do. Oh, it. I know why you're doing this. I yeah. Think. yeah, yeah. So you, when you reassign, check it out. It's not super oh. nice, but it yeah. doesn't mix between upper yeah, and lower yeah. lip. That's a great tip. Yeah. So let me let me do it again. The same thing. Go there. It's a great tip, actually. Yeah, yeah. I do I'm the do same selection, but I reassign when it's the open. Uh, sorry, the close mouth. So. Yeah. Envelope reassign locally and again to the deformance of the. I say, I'm sorry. No, Alan, you, you are yeah. here to correct me. That it's yeah. a, what deformance tongue. It's the lips. <laughs> oh. Sorry, oh, you said tongue, so I. Yeah, yeah, looks like a tongue, tongue to me. Yeah, I'm Spanish and I don't know how to <laughs> speak English. <laughs> I was like, that's kind of strange that he's, he's deforming well, the tongue, but I'm just gonna go with it. Yeah, that's, that yeah, was my sorry, reasoning. Sorry. Well, you see, <laughs> we have now so, these super nice mm, mm, sticky lips. Yeah. yeah. Awful. So, so I'm gonna. Poor guy. Now I need to. Yeah. And the worst part now it's I need to rename again this thing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. It's uh. Spanglish. Uh, yeah, well, no, it's just because I brain farted this part. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we have this, and now you see our lips are, uh, it's not super well enveloped, but 
unless it's not crossing. So yeah, yeah, and and that's because when you when you reassign locally, it uses the current position. Exactly, it's important when you apply it first time the envelope where you apply it, but it, that's the reason because I'm applying only by parts, not all at the same time. Well, you can yeah. do it, but. I found it's cleaner, so you, you one step at a time. And later you do that when it's open the mouth. So you force the lips to, to let's say, to check the near uh, yeah, the yeah. former. That now, it's, I, now I understand why you were not really caring too much about the square mouth. Yeah. I, I was wondering about that. I was like, it's not quite good yet. Yeah, but no. <laughs> but I see, I see where you were going. Yes, no, well, uh, you can spend hours here. I'm yeah. just... Well, actually, uh, you, can just, you can select the loops and smooth uh, yeah, it. I'm gonna Add one more. It, yeah, like that. And uh, yeah, go here. Uh, smooth envelope. Oh, no. Also very important to know that the, the if, if you don't freeze your, your smooth, your smooth is taking into consideration the current positions oh, of, that's your, nice. uh, yeah, of your I like to thing, set so. first uh, the the... the I mean the distance, so I I know where I'm I'm affecting, and when I set the distance, I just add a couple of neighbors and yeah. and, then and then forget to freeze. Yeah, and I'm gonna freeze modeling. It's a, just uh, this ha happens to a few friends. It's happened before so, uh, where they 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 apply a smooth and they're happy with what the smooth did in that pose, and, and then, then they reset it and, and they forget to, fr to uh, freeze it, and then there's their weights change, and they're like, why is it not the same? Yeah. So yeah, you see forget. now it's uh, way better the yeah, way very nice. and yeah you have these nice sticky lips you can continue tweaking the envelopes and so on but you see it takes like honestly if I'm not talking and I don't mistake yeah. any English words <laughs> <laughs> that it takes like ten minutes to, to yeah. rig the mouth and it's super nice so okay I'm gonna stop here enveloping I'm just gonna add the um, the teeth so we can see it uh, choo -choo -choo. The, what is the oh my god here's one oh, of course they are high then one teeth and the upper teeth and oops another nice ice uh, sorry ice trick no nice <laughs> trick oh my god <laughs> okay so another nice trick it's um, you select your object but you don't see anything to click, so you just hide the geometry. So now, right, right, you can, uh, and that way you don't you don't suffer from the enveloping to your own geometry. Yeah, that's bug, another thing, which is so, so annoying. Right click there, and voila, it's done. And for the lower one, yep, hide envelope, yes, and the other. So that's it. Nice. So we have now. The mouth that it can open. Well, the interior needs to be a little work, but yeah. you can see here you have all the teeth and blah blah. Okay, so now we have this uh, envelope thing. Let's check the features on the uh, mouth. Uh, so we have uh, in the in the in gear and all the the models or in the majority of the models we have two two PPGs that we need to take care on that. First one is the animation one that it's what it should be exposed for the animators that uh, in this case because i didn't set any host it will place this ppg under the global and okay. it will create normally global only have uh, the main but we have two more tabs for the two models that we was using the head yeah. model and the mouth that is the actor model that we're talking about yeah yeah and later we have the setup the setup it's another ppg that contains uh, information or preferences that will be set up by the rigger and okay. uh, supposedly it's not meant to be animated. In this case, mm. uh, you can indeed uh, say that it's anim animatable, but uh, in this case, you can see it's any of these parameters can be set as a keyframe. So yeah, yeah, yeah. that's the, the main difference and it should be not touched by the animator. Ah, sorry, <laughs> yeah, by the animator. So, um, Let's set up first the this this object. For the moment, we know that the jab have uh, the different behaviors depend of uh, what axis are you moving. So you have side weights. And I see I see now what you were saying about the 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 null inside the the center of the mouth. So you're using that for this? Yeah, no, for uh, or... this when I rotate. Oh, okay. That is different. Okay. So um, okay. Never mind. <laughs> So we have sides, sides. Okay, sides, it's too much. So you, yeah. you see here, so we want to the maximum there. 
So you see now, this is the maximum. I see. And now we have the, when you go up and down, yeah. you have this, this opening thing. So you can go here and uh, with the axis, define that this is the maximum aperture. Yeah. And yeah, well, up it, you can go as much as you want. And later you have uh, the translation in Z. Okay, that's important. Let's say you have this translation. Then yeah, now it's too, by, too two, by default, yeah, you can yeah, yeah. put it less than one. So now it's, I think the normally I should put this by default one, that it's the most, um, so you have this behavior here. Yeah. And l when you go sides, if you see from the top, you always uh, have also rotation in in the Y axis oh. when you go sides, like when you twist the mouth. So you yeah, can avoid yeah. that or have a little bit. Well, here my oh. envelope, it's not good, but yeah, you yeah. can see the point. And it's not, so not a bad idea. it's way, when you have uh, all this set, it's a really complex movement in a really simple control here, one control. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And the latest one was this medium point that we talk about that you can uh, set and move and, and put it there and so on. So you have this little contact thing and the dragon. Yeah. That is said. Are you using the the new zipper thing in, in your version of gear? No, uh, no, no, no. This one it's not. Uh, so okay. I think this one is an obsolete thing. I should remove. <laughs> <laughs> Cough there. <laughs> and we have this one that it's as the follow uh, um, lips thing. So basically, um, you have the multiplier and you have this this thing. So basically, that what this does it's it's dragging a little bit the teeth and the and the. Uh, well, the teeth should be dry, but this one, that's a, actually, I think I should update this. <laughs> <laughs> but well, for the moment, it's it's what the, you get this dragging effect. So, yeah. so okay. it's more organic, the mouth. Yeah. And again, if you set this dragging effect to zero, it will not, you see when I contact, yeah. it doesn't contact. You need the little dragging. So when you, you drag, you can push your lips. And now yeah, I'm dragging yeah. and pushing, but you can see here it's yeah. pushing. If I remove, oops, not pushing. Mm, okay. Okay. So let's say I destroyed this thing, but I'm going to reset and put this open mouth. So the latest part, this ugly uh, sliders, it's kind of a profile. You can see barely here and basically controls the, um, how it's, uh, these objects be, uh, behaving. For example, you have the corners. The corners are, um, I think, are I don't know where these ones. Yeah. So you can define when you open that this corner go lower and this go um, lower, and this maybe it. this go like that and like that. So and even this one can go like that and this one no, this one no, this one like that. So now when you open the default open and close mouth uh, is this this profile so you can profile a little bit the mouth and would you say it's almost like you could rotate this the yeah. the view sideways and it would match the profile of your sliders i don't understand the question sorry like if you, if you say, you, say you, you hold down l and then rotate your view yeah. um, uh no no i have all the have shortcuts uh, yeah. customized sorry what's, Alan. What's, what's the what's the camera to to tilt but, yeah, to tilt. Uh, I think it's with uh, it's, when it's I L uh, usually, shift. But yeah, this one. Your, yeah. You mean? Yeah, if you if you sh if you shifted ninety degrees, would it match the profile of your of your sliders? Eh, no, really. No? You need to you need to have it like open, and I think the best way to do it's to work is like to okay. to visualize after enveloping, <laughs> and, and that's it. You you because. It's, I mean, it's not a real representation of one to one. Yeah. Indeed, I make one with curves that was like that, but it was a little more confusing. So <laughs> at the end, I, I just <laughs> remove it. Okay. So that is for the setup. Okay. okay. And now uh, the options. So the options we have: quick stick lips. Okay. Why is quick? Because it's it's a cheap version. It's only stick completely. <laughs> lips nothing else so it's the the reason well, it's more for chewing i guess if yeah you put exactly it when, you when it's chewing mouth. if you want to put like chewing like that nom, 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 nom. really tasty okay <laughs> and the other is the compression so when i open it's it, i i can do a, lo a little compression of the mouth so it comprehends oh i see 
So that's the comprehension. And later I have the uh, upper auto translate and lower auto translate. Um, let me show it from the side. So when I go down, you see the, the upper and lower lip. So you can I can force this to, to go oh, up nice. and this one also. So when I open, when I close, when I open, <laughs> when I close. Cool. And this is for the uh, translation. Okay. And let me put this again to zero, because later you have uh, the the other one that it's working, but it's like an offset, so it's, it's oh, always there. Oh, okay. okay. So yeah, yeah. Okay. it's it's not so you can make a combination of this plus this. So this it's always, and this is only when you move. So you okay. you have like this little like I don't know. Yes, yes okay. Dumb lip. Down. Yeah. Yeah. So, and I think that's all for the moment. Uh, remember, it's the first version of the um, uh, mouth um, component for public uh, release. Consumption. Yeah. So it's I uh, found yeah a couple of uh, things that I should review there and there. <laughs> but uh, overall, it's a production uh, proof um, yeah. component, Remember? and it's working really nice. And I think it's it's really fast to set uh yeah yeah, yeah. and well, the, 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 this video is long but if we're not talking and you're setting it up it's really not that bad yeah exactly and how long is this one it's uh 41 minutes oh my god okay <laughs> sorry guys for make you lose these 41 <laughs> minutes of your precious life but i, I hope, hope someone enjoy it and yeah. uh, hopefully it will save you more than 40 41 minutes yeah in the future definitely i hope <laughs> thank you for listening see you next video thanks for, thanks for watching bye bye, -bye. bye, -bye.